Welcome to Marathon Screencast. In this screencast, I will show you how to create a marathon project to test a Java application that is bundled as a binary extendable or a patch script. For this purpose, we will be using a sample application called Swingset 3. Swingset 3 is a demo to showcase features of the Swing UI toolkit. You can download it from the URL displayed on the screen. Let's go ahead with the demo. Let us start by launching Marathonite. Click on New. Provide a name that is descriptive of your testing project in the Name field. Click on Browse and select a project folder. There is no need to provide .mpd as the extension, but it's a good practice. Provide any descriptive text in this field. Now, we'll open the Application tab. Here we select the Command Line Launcher. Note that the Command Line Launcher is only part of Marathonite. Provide the Command Line or the Batch Script here. We are selecting the Swingset 3. .bat. If your application needs to be launched from a particular folder, then provide the working directory. And optionally, you can provide the window data in the window title field. Provide any program arguments required by a batch script and any VM arguments that are required by the virtual machine. If your application requires a different version of Java than the one being run by Marathonite, then select it in the Java Home field. Now that we have provided all the application information, we'll go into the Language tab and select the Scripting Language. At this point, Marathonite only supports Ruby, but we plan to add more languages in the future. Now that we have provided all the information, click on Test to check the configuration. If your configuration is proper, then Marathonite should launch your application. Any errors that may have occurred will be displayed in the Standard Output and Error tab. Click Close to close the application. And we'll click on Save to save the project. The newly created project has already been selected. Thus, click on Select to launch Marathonite. This brings us to the end of this screencast. Thank you for watching.